Welcome to Quick Tips. Jim Holmes from Nolensville, Tennessee came up with an easy way to remind himself when to slow down when he's pulling out the power cord on his RV. All you need is some vinyl tape, the colors of a stoplight, red, yellow, and green. Now we're going to extend the cord all the way to the end. Okay, now the cord is all the way extended and it's time to put the red tape about half a foot from the end so that when you see the red, you'll know to stop. Now that the red is done, it's time for the yellow and you put it about a foot away from the red tape and wrap it around twice so that it's secure. And then you're gonna cut it and when you see yellow, just like at a light, you'll know to slow down. Now we're ready for the green. Now we're done with the tape and we're gonna give it a try and pull it out here. You can see the green, the yellow, and the red, so you know when to slow down and to stop. Good idea. Thanks, Jim. Harold Nelson from Denver, Colorado, kept misplacing his adapters, so he came up with a way to store them by installing a 110-volt receptacle. We're going to put this one in right in this cupboard, but the first thing you need to do is cut a pilot hole to fit this in. Now we have the pilot holes, and we just need to saw the opening for the receptacle. So now we have the hole cut and we just need to screw the receptacle in. Here's the bottom. And now we're just going to get the top. Now we're done and we're going to plug in our adapters. And you don't need wiring because you're just plugging it in for storage. Good idea. Thanks, Harold. Dave Sutherland from Vancouver, Washington found that a traditional office chair mat like this one works perfectly to put beneath your tires when you're storing your RV in wet weather. It's long lasting, it's weatherproof, and it serves as a vapor barrier. And this one fits on dual tires. But if you have a single tire, you can just cut it in two. We're gonna just put it right behind the tire. Okay. Okay, Stu, back it up. Thanks, Stu. And now your tires are protected from the wet ground when you're storing your RV. Thanks, Dave. And those are your quick tips for the week.